And on that topic, the transgender actor and influencer Dylan Mulvaney has uh, been the target of a barrage of uh, attacks from anti-trans individuals online after she did an ad with Bud Light uh, a couple of weeks ago. She's someone who has been here to the White House. She interviewed the President last year. He had a lot of warm words for her. Has anyone here at the White House reached out to her since she became the target of these attacks? So don't have any uh, calls to review at this time, and I don't have anything to say specifically about this report, but what I can say, when a transgender American uh, post a, a, a video about a brand of beer they enjoy, uh, and, it, and it leads to bomb threats, uh, it's clear that that level of violence and vitriol against uh, transgender Americans has to stop. And the president has been very clear. I just laid this out. The administration uh, has uh, is going to do everything that they can to protect LGBTQI plus people who are under attack. And that's what we've been seeing across the country, especially in state houses. And so we're going to fight alongside them to protect their rights. Uh, they should be allowed to be who they are, who they want to be. And they should be able to speak out uh, against, and we should be able to speak out, and others should be able to speak out against hate and discrimination. Uh, but look, that type of uh, uh, dangerous rhetoric, that type of vitriolic uh, uh, language uh, and violence, that needs to stop.